A lease release form, also known as a lease termination letter, is a document that formally releases a tenant from the rental agreement they have with their landlord. This type of form is most commonly used with month-to-month -month leases. In this video, we'll cover how to terminate a lease and what information goes into a lease release form. First, let's review how to terminate a lease. Getting out of a lease agreement can be simple for a month-to-month -month agreement, but more complicated for a longer-term agreement. It is important for both parties of the agreement to have a written or verbal discussion about the reason for breaking the agreement before issuing any formal termination notices or letters. Once the reason for termination is established, the landlord can either send a lease release form or a notice to quit. A notice to quit is different from a lease release form because it gives a tenant an opportunity to rectify any breaches of their lease agreement before the agreement is terminated. Next, let's discuss what information goes into a lease release form. It's important to include the following details in any lease release form in order for it to be legally binding identifying information about the landlord, tenant, and rental property, the lease release date, the tenant's forwarding address, a move-out inspection agreement, a list of utilities that the tenant must turn off or transfer to the landlord, and a certification that the form has been served on the receiving party. So where can you find legal documents online? If you are in need of a lease release form or any other form, we have thousands of state-specific ready-to-go templates available for you to download all for free and with no membership or credit card required. Make sure to grab your template for a lease termination letter at this link right here. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more videos by eForms, the world's biggest database of legal documents.